All right, so it's actually a pretty decent time during the day to where we probably won't find too many PKers. I have a ton of bones in the bank, um, mainly dragon. I have like 500 dragon and then like 100 superior and like 600 big bones. I guess those probably won't give me too much XP, but it's still XP nonetheless. And then I also have a few of these heads as well. I'm going to hope that I can get up to like 81 prayer. I don't even know. I haven't done any of the calculations. I could, but... At the end of the day, I'm just going to use them all anyway. It doesn't really matter. But I'm going to go ahead and use them all, and we'll see what I get to. Like I said, I'm hoping for 81. No specific reason, really. I just want to get my prayer up, honestly. The higher your prayer is, the more prayer points you get back from potions, which will make like my Cerberus trips easier and just everything easier in general. But yeah, let's go ahead and head out to the Lava Maze. We'll see what I can get to. 79 prayer? Very nice. I don't think we got a level. No, we didn't. But yeah, I guess we're going for 80 now. All right, I just missed it, but I just got myself 80 prayer. And I still have some bones left, so I actually might get to 81. Probably not off the bones, but off of the insult heads. But even then, it's going to be pretty close. But at least we have 80. That's pretty nice to see. I like the even numbers. All right, so I just got myself 81 prayer off of that last bone that I just did. And I literally have like 30 more worm bones in the bank, so... That's actually pretty nice, and I haven't even touched the insult heads. I was going to go do all my insult heads right now, but I've got some friends wanting to do some theater of blood, so I'm just going to do the bones for now, and I guess I could do the insult heads later. All right, we just got a hard casket. Let's go ahead and open this up. I want to say we got that on our last clue. Okay, this is my third one, and then this is my second Zami body, so everything else is just um, doesn't really matter either. There's 89 farming, and... I have a long ways to go, 500k till 90, but yeah, it'll be nice to get this thing up to 99 eventually. And I already have the pets, so after 99, I'm literally just never picking up freaking tree seeds again. Well, actually, I'll pick up like the big tree seeds and then trade them over to my main at some point, but there's no reason to go post 99 with trees for me anymore. All right, that's pretty nice. I just got myself 92 magic a little bit ago. Uh, let's see how many do I have of these left. 30. That's not too bad. But yeah, 92 magic looks really good. The next thing I need to go for is 94. But at 92, I actually unlocked Blood Barrage, which is a really good spell to have. Like I said, the next thing is going to be 94 for Ice Barrage. But yeah, it's going up. I kind of just want to do all these barraging tasks. Or I should say bursting. I'm not barraging. But at least until 94, because it would be really nice to get that out of the way for Theater of Blood. I've been doing quite a bit of Theater of Blood. Like, 30 kill count there now. Ice Barrage in some of those rooms are really good. Like, for Maiden, sometimes even on the Crabs at Verzik. Although, you really should just pop them, but sometimes if I'm going with a learner, it's nice to freeze them for them. But yeah, we're making some nice gains on this account. I just got myself another Light Frame. That is my third Light Frame. And I'm closing in on 400 kills now with no Zenites. That's actually crazy luck. I, I don't need those, but those are more rare than Zenites. Jagex is literally having a laugh right now. Honestly, this is not fun anymore. I don't even want to do this task anymore. This is so... <sighs> well, yeah, it's really good luck, but bad. It's such bad luck, dude. It, I could literally make a light frame right now, or a light ballista. <laughs> I'm not going to. I'll make Don't a heavy that. one. Oh, wait for the heavy one. Yeah. That's... I don't understand. <laughs> I have, I think, um, nine items in my name now with no Zenite. Yeah, yeah that's not really cool. I see, <laughs> VA. All right, this should be 90 farming right here. Yeah, there you go. That looks clean, too. 90 farming, and I can now grow redwood trees, so I don't have to use a garden pie anymore to plant redwoods, which is pretty nice. It's not that big of a deal, but... Although, it was kind of annoying when I'd have to turn them into saplings. Like, I would get my whole inventory ready, and then it would be like, you don't have 90 hunter, or not hunter, but 90 farming. So, I mean, I guess it's just a convenience thing. And then also, it just looks clean. Okay, I was not expecting this, but I just got 98 range, so I need 1.2 mil till 99 range. And I also need like 200k till 99 strength and like another 200k till 99, no wait, till 98 attack. I'm almost max combat to be honest, except magic and prayer of course, but these will be really nice to get to 99s. They're almost there. So I, fucking dumb. I think that's my fourth spring. My third Jesus or my fourth? Christ. I, I don't understand. 
it, it's actually maybe our account is broken at four light frames <laughs> three limbs three springs and one tail <sighs> holy shit isn't that dumb that's so dumb <sighs> game sucks it actually does it l i'm <laughs> literally about to like go play another game like what game, what game should I make videos of? Like, Raid Shadow Legends? <laughs> <laughs> I should just full-on Raid Shadow Legends content, dude. I heard that's a good game, yeah. It's better than this one. You can actually get stuff. Yeah, for sure. Yes! Oh, I finally got it! Oh, okay, um... Let's go. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I actually can't believe I finally got that. That is... Oh, that's my ring of suffering and I can go to Zolra. I can't believe they're actually 15.3 mil now, too. That's... These are really expensive. But let's see what the KC was for this. And there we go. That's the KC. 701 KC. So I went a little over two times the drop rate for Zenite. Um, I got a ton of this other stuff, though. So, I mean, I hit the drop table several times. It's just, it's ridiculous that I'm getting everything that's more rare. But I finally got a shard. That's so nice to see. I am going to sell some Chaos Runes for Talkle. How many do I have? 34,000. That should be enough for an Onyx. And then I can make a Suffering. So I've actually run out of gold bars. I cut all my gems, and then I made a bunch of emerald amulets, and I made a couple of sapphire amulets. I should probably make more, but I have no gold bars, so I need to make a bunch of gold bars. I'll probably make addy bars as well, because in the future I'm going to get a blowpipe, and I'm going to need to make addy darts for that. I might even make some steel bars as well for cannonballs. I don't know, but I just need to do a bunch of gold ore, so that's going to get me up some levels. I'm like 74 right now. So it's gonna be pretty nice. But yeah, I just wanna get 87 crafting right now. So if I get another Zenite, I can make an Anguish as well. And I won't have to like, go train for it. But yeah, currently 64k till 75 smithing. I'm probably just gonna do a bunch and then show you guys my level afterwards. I don't know exactly how long I'm gonna do this for. I'm just gonna do it until I get bored. And then um, yeah, I guess we'll see what our level is. It should be 75 smithing right here. Yep, there we go. Um, I... Yeah, no, that map. Wait, Dragon Kite Shields? I will probably never get a Dragon Kite Shield on this account. Okay, I hope I don't lag too hard here. I think it's lagging a little bit. But, um, basically, I got myself enough Tackle to go ahead and buy myself another Onyx. Let's go ahead and buy that. And then I have to piece that together with my Zenite to make an uncut Zenite. And then I can make a Ring of Suffering. Alright, now we use the Zenite on the Flame Wall. Yes, fuse them together, and there is a uncut Zenite. Let's go ahead and cut this. Oh god, I don't even have the... Mm. I actually made the Zenite ring on only one stew. I had a bunch of them ready, but uh, I got the boost right away. I forgot to record me actually making it though, but let's go ahead. Oh, I actually didn't even think about enchanting it. I'm glad that it's only 93 and not like 97 or something. So I guess I need to get a magic potion out of the bank really quick. Uh, magic pot. Let's do this, and then now we can enchant Zenites. Let's make this into a ring of suffering. Let's go over here, and then I'm going to enchant this ring. Because it basically doubles the stats, it brings the defense stats up. Wait, what are the prayer stats? Does it double the prayer stats too? What is it right now? Two? So it does double the prayer stats. Because it jumps from 2 to 4. Upgrades. Yes, I want to do that. Now we got a Ring of Suffering imbued. Which gives me a very tanky ring. And I can do Zora with this now. Because I can put recoils in there. I mean, I could do it with just regular recoils. But it, it's not very fun. I reckon I could show you the stats if you've never seen them before. But yeah, it's 20 literally and everything. And then 4 prayer. So it's a pretty beastly ring to be honest. It's really good at Sarah as well, if you're not flicking the minions. There's a lot of places it's actually best in slot at. Alright guys, well I'm going to go ahead and end the video off right here. It seems like a pretty decent spot to end it. 
Now I can start my Zulra grind now that I have a Ring of Suffering. I mean, I've done a few kills before, so I mean, I, I guess it's not like the first kill or anything, but I don't have like any of the uniques right now. But hopefully we can get something on the next video. I'm really hoping I can get lucky there. And yeah, and until next time, I forgot my bottomless bucket. But yeah, until next time, I'll see you guys later. Peace out.